There is no limit to what we, as women, can accomplish. Michelle Obama A very warm good morning to my teachers and my dear friends. On this auspicious occasion, I am incredibly delighted to deliver a short but motivational speech on Women's Day. March 8th is observed as International Women's Day to honor the achievements of women in various fields. As I stand before you all on an occasion so special and worthy of celebrations, I feel immense happiness that we, as a whole, are making progress and women are getting the kind of respect they deserve. My friends, you must be wondering why March 8th is designated Women's Day. There is however a brief 109 year history surrounding it. A political party in America commemorated 15,000 women who demonstrated in New York City in 1909. Against concerns like low wages, equal opportunities, and no voting rights. Initially observed on March 8th, it was originally known as National Women's Day. As word of this spread, annual celebrations were held worldwide. The United Nations first acknowledged International Women's Day in 1975. And starting in 1996, Women's Day became a theme to celebrate women in the community. International Women's Day aims to promote and proclaim to the globe that all genders should be treated equally. The day's goal was to highlight many facets of a woman's life in a world dominated by men, alter people's perspectives around the world, and influence the world positively. Four out of every five women encounter harassment. They are incredibly prone to experience domestic abuse and sexual assault as children. Every day, more than 30,000 girls are coerced into underage marriages, other girls suffer from illicit trafficking and female genocides. Today, women have equal employment opportunities and are permitted to compete with males, occasionally surpassing them in many industries. Today's women realize they have the skills and potential to leave the house and contribute positively to their community. Women's participation strengthens peace agreements, strengthens society, and strengthens economies. Women in the current day no longer rely on men. She is capable of accomplishing everything like men and is independent and self-assured. Additionally, we should respect each of them for their unique identities rather than their gender. Women of today unquestionably live in a better world than women of the past. However, there are still issues that require attention. Despite all the efforts, the average woman still works twice as much as the average guy but is underpaid. They endure horrific atrocities and intimidation to fulfill their true desires. Women now hold the highest positions in every industry and take on the most extraordinary responsibilities that history has ever seen. Men are now coming up to support women's empowerment efforts, precisely how women in the 1800s envisioned the world. Let's all honor, respect, and adore all the amazing women in our life on this International Women's Day, whether they are your mother, wife, or daughter. Let's demonstrate our pride in their achievements and commitment to building a world free of all ills for women. To end with some lovely words, all I can say is, women are warriors fighting without swords and conquering through love.